okay and hello and welcome back to this channel for new visitors don't forget to subscribe to this youtube channel for more updates for this android kotlin programming tutorial you will learn about how to display biograph data an android chart tutorial series yes so let's start you can post the video and then type the codes while watching this video here is the initial setup that project our normal routine first go let's go to project structure this is the brother gradle gra plugin version we use gradle version and then our manifest this is the setup so our gradle properties is this yeah, we have add to under the universe to fire j center and also psw binding enable true and the star of the for this tutorial we need to import this library on our build gradle chart com that github fill j and android chart Yes, so here is the complete setup of the view. After they import the uh, the library in Gradle, you can use this chart. Yes, important to use this bar chart. Also, yes, the parent. So let's go to main activity. We have an initial setup. The code this is the view binding. The view binding. And so on. So let's start to let's start the code. First, we must declare this function. Let's control enter. Automatic create a So this is the important if we need to add value in our bar chart we need to add the profit value in array list Excuse me uh, <clears throat> The next is the first value is an x This will be the what do you call this the column Column position And the second value is this is the x value, the row position. So we need to copy paste this to insert the any value. Maybe we we'll try to buy items. Ah, uh, for later on you will appreciate the value what we are doing right now.
Now we have a manual at value. Manual at value of the, our chart. Uh, later on, if you're using an API, you can only use this one item only, and you can for loop or uh, for loop if it is an array list of your value data. But this are uh, for sake of tutorial, we only use the manual at manual value dot on our bar chart. So let's start to build the code of our R or bar chart. So, let's start. I forgot to say this when adding a value, we need to enter the our data in, into float because we, the paragraph is the float, we use only the two double or integers, they will an error. So it's important to transform, important to transform into float. Uh, that's it. Like for example, it's only float. Okay, I just continue to hold up it. Just watch and follow this feature.
Okay, while waiting to build the application device. For new visitors, don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel for more updates. So, okay, let's display the uh, value. Yes, this is it. Here is our setup and value. Here, so if you change the data for the row, how about to display for So we change the value zero to data. Here is the paragraph uh, and the tutorial. So in your okay, it goes to my senior bar graph size in the IX command. So that's it. Uh, okay. For tagline, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel and hit the notification bell for more updates. Android programming tutorial. If you watch this video, add some reviews and thank or thank you for for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. And for next tutorial in the future, we add some other Android chart tutorial. It's free. So thank you again. See you next time.